Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel, She's French, and if you're new, welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing and stay a while, join the community. So for today's video, I decided to start doing some monthly favorites, but relating to my baby. So Zen is currently five months old, so I wanted to do baby favorites based on the last month, so four months. I actually wish I had started this earlier because I think it's so helpful um, and it's just like cute to talk about, but also interesting the things that are such a big hit with babies. Sometimes it's unexpected. So I'm gonna talk about things that he's really into and then things that I'm also into. Um, Ryan and myself as his parents. Sorry, just cutting in from the future, literally <laughs> 10 minutes after shooting this video. Just wanted to put a little disclaimer. Um, I hate that I have to put this, but just in case, please don't mom shame anybody. Being a mom is so hard and um, it's like brand new like no one knows how to be a mom right so we're all doing our best um i'm also <laughs> doing my best i do a lot of research for zen and like the products i bring into the house and what i expose him to but you know like this is stuff i'm learning as is happening pretty much so please 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 be respectful be kind um i feel like i don't have to say this like my little viewer base and community is great but just in case um just be supportive, be kind, and yeah, let's get back into the video. So first, I wanted to talk about the things that I cannot hold up in front of you. The first one is his high chair. I have the Nomi high chair. This was a big decision to make. I'm including this right now because I've had it since before he was born, but just now he's starting to sit in the chair and um, hold himself up and enjoy it. We actually put him in there sometimes when we're working, we put him next to us. And then we also have him sit with us when we're eating dinner, lunch, breakfast, whatever, just so he can be around us. We like to have him around us all the time. And um, we're actually taking the Montessori approach. So kind of having him watch us do things and then interact with us and just be involved like a little adult, but as a baby, right? So. The Nomi chair is great. I love how it looks. I think it's super sleek, but it's very user-friendly too. Um, I think it's just like a fantastic chair. It's actually the upgraded version of the Stoke Trip Trap. I guess the story of the Nomi is that the maker of Stoke started to go through his design again. Stoke was originally for his kids, I believe. And as the kids got older and had their own kids, he redesigned it into the Nomi for his grandchildren. So it's a great chair. It's, um, it just makes sense. It's a smart chair. I've um, added a picture for you guys to see. I got mine secondhand, which was so amazing. I drove an hour to pick it up, but I'm so glad I did. It's actually quite expensive, but I think it is a good investment if you are even buying it new because eventually you can, um, take off the levels and make it fit uh, for bigger kids. I think it's good up until they're like teenagers, honestly. I don't know that Zen will want to use this when he's a teenager, but basically it's going to grow with him. I didn't get the tray attachment for the Nomi. I just pull it up to our tables. Montessori, they don't really recommend um, having the tray attachment. It's more like eating at the table with you. So that's what we've been doing and he's really enjoying it and I really enjoy having him around. It's like, wait, I can move it easily. So highly recommend. Just a quick note um, while I was rewatching this, Zen is not as of right now eating with us yet, but he is um, at the table with us. Um, he's actually ready to start food now. So that's gonna be for this month, but just real quick, just in case. <laughs> The next item is the LV breast pump. Um, right now, I, I have it, I could hold it up, but it's um, I just washed it so it's drying and stuff. It's a fantastic breast pump and I've been using it a lot because, uh, well, obviously I'm breastfeeding, but 
right now he's kind of changing his like eating pattern and sometimes when he's napping I kind of want to get ahead and store some milk for later so I'll be using it and it's so user friendly I work from home I don't feel like I have to stop anything the LV is a wearable pump you just put it in your bra it's so easy to use um, you charge it with like a USB cable it's it's like the iPhone of breast pumps right so I've been loving it I've been using it a lot and I highly recommend it for me the LV was not um it was not through insurance I bought it myself I bought it second hand um on Mercari I got a good price for it because I was just buying it myself there was no reimbursement I had the Medela I think the pump in style I absolutely hated it it was really hurting my back I had a lot of issues with back pain after having him um I went to like PT for it it was pretty bad even acupuncture so being hunched over with the Modelo was just not user-friendly not enjoyable I hated the process and um the cleanup was also not my favorite and um the bottles get like foggy and stuff I just didn't like it saw the LV saw the big hype I was like is it worth it you know what actually yes a wearable pump makes such a difference I can walk around I can work so highly recommend that also the last thing that I cannot hold up to you guys is a little play mat that I got him I have the play mat in our living room we have um, a pretty small apartment and you know like I kind of care about what my stuff looks like and I don't really want like super crazy colors and actually Montessori it's not like that bright it's more of like a relaxing environment so I wanted something that I found pleasant to be around too and that he would enjoy so I got him a little play mat from Amazon it's um, like a terracotta color with little rainbows I'll add a picture um, the price was decent I was looking at a lot of large play mats and they're very expensive you can definitely find this style cheaper, but this one looks good. That's essentially what you're paying for. The other thing that's nice is that the panels are bigger. So you only have, I believe it's six pieces to put together. We had one that was given to us. That was the alphabet and it was cute, but there was literally like 30 pieces that you had to put together. So the idea is that these are like puzzle pieces are easy to like pack up when you're not using them, but actually you don't want to put away 30 pieces so this one's user friendly it's cute and um i really like it i have it on top of carpet but it's also great on top of hardwood flooring so that it's softer for your baby he's been really enjoying it and i can see him um start to like kind of move around all as if he's like trying to crawl not yet but i can see him trying and i think it's helping him it gives him like a good grip so that's been great too. The next items I have in front of me, so I'm gonna show you. The first one is the Sophie Giraffe. This is like a baby classic, right? Um, we got this for him a little bit early when we first got it. He was not into it and we we're like, oh, like, is he just not like a Sophie baby? But now that he's starting to like do a little bit of teething, he will like go to town on this and he's really enjoying it. Um, this is a really smart product. Um, it's like natural rubber, but also like every little part of the Sophie is made that it's like nice for them to chew on. So he'll chew on the legs, chew on her head and then her ear. Like he just really likes it. So that's been great. The next little toy is this one. <laughs> it's so funny like what babies are into because my my friend Jessica got this for me. She has um, a son. She said this was his favorite. And I was like, oh, like a ball. But actually this ball is like Zen's favorite thing ever. Thank you so much, Jessica. Um, it has little like rattle balls and it's just like really cool. He can grip it really well. He actually takes it in the bath with him. He loves it in the bath. Um, it's just like a great little ball. He's really into it. Also, it's bright, so I think it like catches his attention. He's really into green. Um, he loves trees, loves plants. So this is really cool and um, a great little toy. And then these are things that I've been into for him, but he enjoys it. The first one is a baby bum lotion. We try to do like very natural products. Um, 
this is something that we're careful about for ourselves. So of course it's going to translate um, into taking care of our son and the products that we get for him. This is the banana coconut scent and it smells so good. Um, it has that like artificial banana smell, but I think that smell is like one of the best smells on the planet. So I love it. The only thing was with this is that it's a little bit watery. It's not super, super emollient, but I think it's good. Um, it like, if your baby is like very wiggly, you can get this on your baby pretty fast. Um, and he just enjoys the massage and then he smells really good. So this has been really good. And the last thing I figured I would show you a cute little baby outfit. Ryan picked this out. So it comes with little ears it's from Target. This is a little hat. It's all knitted. These are the little joggers. Is he? So cute. And they're so soft and they're so well made. I love them. And then it comes with a little sweater with a little pocket. Everything together is so cute and it's cozy, it's soft and it's warm. So we love this little outfit for him. So that concludes my four month um, baby favorites for Zen. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm gonna start doing them monthly because I think it's fun to like talk about the little baby things we're into and like what he's into as well. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Bye guys. Yeah.